Blackpool Central Coastal Defence Scheme consisted of 3.2 kilometres uh, of new sea defence to replace the existing sea defence, about 100 years old. The scheme, simplistically, was precast step revetment, wave wall, uh, setback wall in some areas, and new promenade. The project started on site in 2005. Uh, and the most recent phase was, was completed in June of this year. The Top Force product and the other products Tarmac developed for this scheme uh, lent themselves in particular to the aesthetic quality that was required. Over the 3.2 kilometres, as you can imagine, maintaining the consistent colour, uh, the unique colour for this scheme was a challenge. Uh, and also for the promenades, the use of coloured aggregate along with uh, the coloured concrete was of critical importance. The use of synthetic macro reinforcement on this project was a huge benefit, primarily because of the durability characteristics. Clearly the removal of steel reinforcement in this harsh environment was an advantage for the design life and the durability of the structures. In addition, there were productivity advantages because the macro reinforcement was in the, within the body of the concrete meant that the steel reinforcement fixing activity could be deleted from the programme and therefore uh, increase the outputs put in the every working shift. The customer, as Blackpool Council, was very keen to ensure that the finished finish scheme met their aesthetic aspirations, and we believe we achieved that through the use of the Top Force and other Tarmac products. Tarmac provided a very good service for the scheme as a whole. They dedicated uh, a batching plant to the scheme, but they allowed us to give consistency of quality and finish both for the site works and for the precast elements that were manufactured at the factory dedicated to this project five miles up the road. The technical support provided for the scheme was invaluable, uh, particularly to deal with the evolving needs and problems as they arose due to climatic conditions, weather conditions and changing customer requirements. This proved invaluable to deliver the scheme on time to the required quality.